It's always been a love of mine. I grew up going to the movies. I spent most of my college undergraduate career going to a free movie on campus every night. It's so much more than I expected. Of course, I've had Dr. Gaines in the past, so I've come to expect the unexpected with him. He's pretty chill as far as conversation goes, but he takes our conversations just way out of the box, opens them up to all sorts of ideas and opinions. They were between 98 and 82, except for one and that person's not here, so that person shouldn't worry right now. <laughs> oh, I love this class. All the films that we get to watch are really interesting, and he opens up a sometimes provocative discussion about what are the films trying to say, what does the director mean by this, what does he want the audience to feel, and there's always those little paideia moments. I try to give a sense of what feels like a canonical, broad strokes of what people should know from 1915 with Griffith, the beginning of the narrative medium, to third world cinema of late. I think that from a social justice standpoint, the, the class has a lot to offer as far as opening our eyes to the injustices and the atrocities really that occur. But also the more human sides, the more loving and nurturing nature of individuals, even in the most dire and drastic situations that they happen to find themselves in in the films in the class. They have some way of really coming out of that and showing you that in spite of all of these awful things, there's still a hope for not just those in the film, but for all of us. It's really fun to see what plays. I mean, I just finished reading midterms and the students loved Bicycle Thieves, 1949 neo-realist film, which I like and I appreciate, but I felt like I was doing it out of obligation, and then I read the midterms and students go, this is the best movie we've seen in years. And so it's the thrill of being able to share with people and introduce people to things they haven't seen before, too.